Nick's Adventures, yeah! Hey everyone, welcome back to Nick's Adventures, and today we are going to see the V280 Tilt Rotor Aircraft. Now this plane, or helicopter, I mean, can get rotors or propellers from a uh, upward angle to a downward angle to increase speed. So let's get right into the video. The ability to do a roll-on landing in tilt rollers not only provides more capability, but adds to a survivability element to the aircraft. This allows the crew to stay on the wing longer, thus reducing the power required to actually do the high gross weight or emergency landing profile. Once the aircraft has touched down, the pylons can be rotated back to the 95 degree position, providing great action to assist in slowing the aircraft to a stop. The aircraft is now able to convert very quickly and perform an approach to a hover. The aircraft can then land on an objective in vertical or BTOL mode. This tactical advantage drastically reduces exposure time at the objective in the terminal area. Hover control and stability and fully augmented the aircraft requires a very low pilot workload. Completely fly by wire. B-280 flight control software translates pilot command into movement of the control system and the rotor blade to a certain redundant to the electrical and hydraulic system. We have a flight control system providing excellent precision of the capabilities. The B-280 is capable of 45 knots, 5 words, 1, and excellent controllability with the control demonstrated superb agility and low speed and hover flight, having achieved the Army's stringent level 1 agility standard in pitch, yaw, and roll. The rotor size and increased rotor flapping capability of the B-280 exceeds that of previous tilt rotors, giving it exceptional control power and agility at the S. 
as well as reduce downwash. the aircraft turns final, then we send a transition to zero degrees pylon or the cruise mode. This lower pylon angle allows the aircraft to operate more like a turbo prop, using the wing to provide the majority of lift and using the prop rotors for forward thrust. This is the feature of the Z280 that gives it endurance and speed well beyond that of any other rotorcraft configuration. The speeds you are seeing today are faster than the cruise speed of any military helicopter in operation today and represent only a portion of the max capability of this, the B-2-8. Thank you to the dedicated team at Bell and the Alliance Air Show for allowing all of us the B-280 test team to demonstrate the revolutionary aircraft. At Bell, we have a saying, to win the fight, you have to be in the fight. And the B-280 will deliver the knockout punch. Wave goodbye to the B-280 as it heads back to Arlington for more testing as the Bell team looks to support the Army's long-range assault aircraft program and their initiative to modernize our nation's forces. Ladies and gentlemen, Bell has done it again. Give them a big round of applause. The innovation, the heritage, and the first we have from Bell are fantastic. And thank you to Matt Academy for providing us full of these great technical information. You saw it here first, perhaps, unless you're around Arlington. If you're from out of town, you and I saw it for the first time today and yesterday. And what a great machine it is. Drop low, let's rock. Hey, thanks, Danny. What a demonstration, folks. It's the Bell Forward Alliance Air Show. Hey, everyone. Hope you enjoyed the V280 video. Make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and if you like this video, leave a like. Have more adventures, and I will see you next Saturday. Bye-bye.